Hello, it's Nancy today. Thought I would relax. Been walking the labyrinth, snowshoe labyrinth. That's what I call the two alder labyrinth and stream labyrinth. They're all called snowshoe labyrinth. Here I am lying in my hammock relaxing and look at this awesome view I have. I'm in my hammock, in my teepee. I didn't cover the whole teepee because I just like the idea of being able to sit here and watch it snow. How many places can you do that? Oh, I like to I like to rock a bit in my hammock too. Um, see, I've got all these hides I'm laying on. I keep it nice and warm here. See? You see my hides here? I don't know if I'm showing you or not. I like it in here. You should go build yourself a, a, a teepee. All you gotta do is cut down, I guess it's 16 trees. You gotta cut down 16 cedars, take all the take all the branches off, tie them together in the center. Just three of them you tie together. Two going that way and one coming the other way. So you tie the, the tops of them at 19 feet. You lash them, you know, like you would a Girl Scout thing. One, two, three, up. Anyway, you lash them three times. Then you pick the middle up and stick it on a chair. Push the one that's all by itself walk inward with that and stab it back into the ground and you keep doing that until it's standing up and you you move them around so that they're a triangle okay I gotta show you the snow this looks really cool I met somebody yesterday from South Africa who had never seen it snow I mean I'm almost kidding around when I make these Nancy Todays and they're like you know if you've never seen it snow but they hadn't they hadn't seen it snow at all oh here a car they can't see me I can just see this beautiful piece. You know why I built this down here? Because it's just the most wonderful, beautiful place. There's a that is such a wilderness over on the ice side. See, that's the marsh woods. The beavers flooded it over and over. Lots of trees have died. But it's such a wonderful place because there's trees growing out of stumps and things like that. And then there's the stream between here and there. I just love this place. And I don't be I don't come down here very much because well, this is just a little triangle in the corner of our property, and you don't go to every inch of your property, right? You just don't do that. You go, unless it's a little property. It was a pretty big one here. If you go, but so doing my labyrinth, going around and around and back and back and back and back, I'm, I'm walking almost every inch of this little area down here. It's so nice because I'm seeing all these bushes and the, the woods and the stream. I'm seeing it from all these angles as I walk. Man, is it ever snowing hard. It looks so nice out. Does this pick it up how it's snowing? I hope you can see it, because it's just so nice. When they show you the weather on the news, and they say, Oh man, it's snowing. They always show you where they've already taken the snow away. Or they show you somebody shoveling off their car. Like, hello, is that reality? I mean, is that all that's important? Is how it, you know, messes up your car and your road? Sometimes I wonder what it's like to be a tree and live down here. They're here through everything. You can't really tell it, but back there, way back there, that's the hill. We live way up on the hill back there. So we have to walk down pretty far to get to this spot. That's why it's so nice to have a nice, nice place to lie down. See, you can just push your foot against the tree. Well, if you can reach it, jeepers. I can, I can reach this one here, you see, I can get myself moving with my hand up on that one. See, and now I'm rocking. You can rock with me if you like. Hey, my hide just fell down. That was my pillow. Come on back up here, you folded up hide. Ooh, I should really just put it underneath, over my legs. But then I don't have this nice tall pillow. I like the pillow thing. I know, I could use another one, but that means I have to get up. I have this huge stack over there. I tanned hides one year. Oh man, they're both my mittens. Okay, I'm done. Goodbye. There goes my 